Okay, so RN asked a question that suppose we are suspecting meningitis in a patient and we did a CSF and we started the patient on antibiotics and other supportive treatment. Now, when we should repeat the CSF to see what are how the CSF is responding. So, what does the guideline say? So, the guidelines say that if your patient is clinically improving, how you will see that the patient is neurologically improving, the patient is becoming conscious and you know, the patient is uh, having, uh, the fever trend has gone down, means you know that the patient is clinically improving. So we call that the patient has responded to the treatment in such case and we should not repeat CSF. There is no guideline to say that we need to repeat CSF in such patient. We know that the patient is responded to the treatment. But in adults, if the patient is not responded and the patient is not showing any sign of improvement in next 48 hours after doing the CSF and starting the therapy, then in such patients, you need to repeat the CSF to see whether we are dealing with drug resistance or any other complication like ventriculitis, subdural empyema or cerebral abscess-like thing to see the complication. So in non-responders, you need to repeat the CSF after 48 hours. So this is the guideline say. Thank you for asking and do read more about it. Thank you.